More states are taking action against the e-cigarette epidemic sweeping the country. In Massachusetts, the Department of Public Health is ordering health providers to report all suspected cases of vaping-related lung disease. Now some companies selling vaping products in Worcester say they are worried it may affect their business. Upper Chandler Walsh joins us in Worcester now with more. Chandler. Olivia, there haven't been any reported vaping related lung illnesses here in Massachusetts, but local doctors say it's only the tip of the iceberg. Vaping shops say the illnesses are not caused by nicotine vaping, but from doctored THC products. Health officials warn against vaping. It's really not clear that it's safe. Is vaping safer than smoking? It's something like this that is jumping from 600 feet safer than jumping from 700 feet. The CDC reports more than 450 illnesses and six deaths linked to vaping. St. Vincent doctor Ahmad Siddiqui says there isn't enough information to determine why. He says it could be one of the chemicals in e-cigarette liquids or from a high concentration of nicotine. Nicotine has ill effect on the heart. Nicotine has an effect on, on almost every other, you know, all the organs in the body. So it, it's, it's, it's possible. The state's Department of Public Health is now requiring doctors to report any possible vaping-related lung illnesses. If you are seeing patients that you know are vaping and have these pulmonary problems, don't wait until it gets to the point where they're on a ventilator and in an ICU. Report that. Worcester's Department of Public Health says the cases in question are linked to products laced with THC. Vaporize on Park Ave says these are black market cartridges, and people who use regulated products are not at risk. It's all I think uh, in these states are not recreational-wise or medical-wise for marijuana. Um, and after these are actually all black market cartridges, it's actually a big, big thing. Even though it's still considered vaping, it's just kind of misinformed because they're kind of shoving it all together. The Trump administration is proposing a ban on flavored e-cigarette products. Vaporize has started selling CBD products, and they're worried about their business. It might actually wipe us out as a business. Meanwhile, Dr. Siddiqui expects to see long-term conditions caused by vaping in the coming years. A lot of different um, uh, uh, effects down the line um, if this continues the way it's, it is. Dr. Siddiqui says nicotine also affects brain development and mental health, especially in youth. New federal guidelines will go through a public comment period before taking effect. In Worcester, Chandler Walsh, Worcester News Tonight.